Tracy Casey Arnold, CEO and founder of Whatever It Takes Consulting, Whatever It Takes Ministry, and the Whatever It Takes Radio Show. Just coming to you for a few moments to talk about our monthly ministry message, Carry On Baggage. Now, I don't know about you, but I'm a woman and I know I've got a lot to say when it comes to carry on baggage. And that is why this month's topic is so important as we step out of 2015 and walk into the year of the vineyard and what God has for us in 2016. And so with that, you guys, make sure you join us at our monthly socials so that you can get connected, receive the word of the Lord, and hear what he has to say about how he values you, what he has for you, and how you just need to trust in him and you will receive a year of abundance. You know, 2 Corinthians 5, 17 states, therefore, if anyone is in Christ, the new creation has come. The old has gone and the new is here. That is exactly what God has for you. I mean, think about it. It's just like taking a new flight. The flight of 2016. If you carry on all these baggage, number one, think about all the fees you're going to have to pay and how expensive that is. And God does not want you to be in a deficit in 2016. On top of that, think about all of the moving and man, taking time to try to fit it all in the up hand bends. And let me tell you what, what God has for you, you don't have to force. It's already there. You just have to receive it. And then think about what that flight would be like bumpier. Man, maybe it would take longer. It may even steer you away from the destination that God has for you. And let me tell you what, what God has for you, when you align yourself with him, you get rid of things that are carrying you or burning you down, you will be able to receive. And it's amazing how when you do that, all these things just start lining up and you think, man, this was easy. All I had to do is walk in faith walk in confidence and believe in my Lord that it was there and go search and find those treasures. And man, my life is completely different. And that's the life that God wants for you in 2016. He has no desire for us to keep repeating the same thing over again, unless we're like some of us, hard-headed. We just, man, want to keep staying in that mess. We want to keep paying those fees and we don't mind showing up at the wrong location each year. I don't think so. We're women. We work hard and we want to be able to receive 100% the life, the marriage, the relationship with our kids, our career that God has for us. So with that, you guys, I hope to see you guys at our monthly socials. Again, we're in San Antonio, Central Texas and Austin, and now in Dallas. You guys be blessed and I look forward to talking to you soon.